y'all i'm about to go ahead to go do this girl's frontal for her um i've been wanting to practice like applying wigs and frontals and closures on people so um i told her i would do it so y'all wish me luck i'm trying to work on my application because you know i'm trying to be out here slam folks other than myself um so yeah about to go do that and i think i'm about to get me a little two-piece snack from popeyes because i'm hungry still even after eating that little Whopper Junior. So, I'm about to go eat that and then go and slay this frontal. What's up, y'all? It's your girl. It is Tuesday, and you guess what I'm doing? <laughs> Cleaning an Airbnb because, you know, that's what I do in my spare time. Um, And, yeah, that's all I'm doing today for right now. I might go take a run at Walmart to get some stuff for the house. Um, But other than that, I'm just cleaning cleaning and either in my car one of the two but yeah let me get back to cleaning so y'all i'm just currently sitting on the couch waiting for the sheets to dry so i can make these beds and bounce um i'm gonna go to walmart and get some cutlery um i'm trying to think what else i needed for the house um cutlery and something else i don't quite remember but yesterday i got my pinky nail fixed um actually maybe i'll go back and get the rest of my nails fixed because um it's my other hand but my pinky nail looks so brand new and pretty and my other nails look busted and crusted so actually i might go back today and get the rest of my uh nails done um it was only five dollars to fix my nail yesterday which i didn't think it was gonna be that cheap but it was and that came with the the polish and everything too um so i think i'm going to go and get like a fill and have them repolish everything so i'm not looking all crusty dusty um i want to do something nice for my boyfriend but i don't know what like i want to do like just something nice for him um and jam yeah. I'm waiting for my ad board to come in for this new Faha because this one kind of leaves some welts on my skin and it's like making my stomach itch. So I feel like if I put the board, it'll help with the welts and stop the itching on my stomach. But other than that, feeling good. Um, and yeah, I guess we'll just see when I go to Walmart. I honestly don't really do anything throughout the day, so. I try to vlog, but I don't really, I do the same thing. I clean, occasionally go to the store, but a lot of times I'm just in my house, so. So y'all, I am done cleaning. It is currently about to be 1.30. I'm about to go get the rest of my nails done since I only did this nail and it looks so new compared to the rest of them. So that looks crazy. I think I'm gonna just do the same color because I like this color. Um. So, I'm gonna hit a Walmart, you know what I'm saying? Get me some nice body scrubs and probably hit up City Trends, get me a little outfit, you know what I'm saying? Not that kind of outfit. Bro, this white girl is in the middle of the street twerking. Oh, bro. Oh, at least I can turn my camera around. Bro, I don't know if y'all think. I want to turn it. Y'all missed it. She was in the street over there. I don't know if you can see her. She was over there twerking just now. Her little cheeks was moving. Oh my gosh. Anyway, back to what I was talking about. But I want to give me a cute little outfit. You know, seeing a little outfit. Um, and give me some nice body scrubs and just shower and smell good and look good and feel good and just be like looking like a snack. So get my nails done hands because my toes got gel so my toes is good scrubs from walmart and some smell good like lotions kind of things smell nice and a little outfit so let's go where are we going to the nail place yay to get our nails done i don't like when you're in a parking lot and people take up the whole middle row like you're supposed to be on one side and i'm supposed to be on one side so i could pass you could pass but you want to be in the middle so nobody could pass does that make sense no 
But anyway, I'm gonna go. Ooh, they got people sitting outside. That means people trying to get their nails done today. Tink. So, they told me it's going to be about a 45 minute wait. So, I think I'm going to go in TJ Maxx to waste time. I'm going to try and see if they got some scrubs in there because honestly, I don't really feel like going in Walmart and that's all I really need is like some body scrubs. So, I'm going to see. Maybe TJ Maxx got some body scrubs in there. And I'm trying to think what else is in this plaza that I could possibly go in. Bed, bath, and beyond. But I feel like that's like house stuff. I don't know. Let's try TJ Maxx to waste time and hopefully maybe never know what I could find. Y'all, the parking lot for TJ Maxx is so full, but I should have known because it's about to be Christmas and everybody's doing a little shopping or whatever. Also, they have a Bills outlet, which is like a trashier version of TJ Maxx, but I'll see what they have in there too. So TJ Maxx used to have a bunch of body scrubs, but I don't see them anymore. All I see is like body soaps and face stuff. I guess they got rid of it. But they had some scrubs and I wanted some. It's so cute. How cute is that? Look at this bag, it's so cute. It kind of reminds me of that Prada bag that I see everybody in. Here's a black version. But the pink one, I don't know, just pink just stands out to me. But I know I can see this getting so dirty. And I'm not going to be able to wear it with everything, but it's only $20. I don't know if I should just get the black one or the pink one. Okay, these are so cute. Got a bunch of crap, as usual. So guys, I was thinking about what I wanted to do for my boyfriend and I decided I'm going to give him a, like a little spa night, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to get like the little foot soaker thing, I'm going to give him a little pedicure, I'm going to give him a facial, a massage, like all of that. So I ended up buying that purse that I saw in TJ Maxx. So I'm actually about to use it now because I'm extra. Even though it doesn't go with anything that I got on, but that's okay because I just be carrying my wallet just in my hand. And I don't like having stuff in my hand and having like big bags. So yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got. I just got some exfoliating sponges, it's two in a pack. It's like $5. I got these super cute love notes that go on the fridge. I thought that was cute. Um, then just like a little face brush and some um, exfoliating wash for his face while I was in there. And then I wanted to try this crispy marshmallow bars. Um, this is by Philosophy and it smells really good. So that's why I got it. it smells like um, Rice Krispies. So that's nice. And then I got him a set of knives for the house because I had got him some before, but for the reason like they just disappear in thin air. I'm, I need to get some cutlery, but they didn't have any in there, which I'm surprised they didn't. But just a cute little knife set. This was only $10. Um, and then I got him a little thing to put his soap in and a little, came with a little sponge. This was $10 as well. And then for his feet, this came in a three pack. So I thought that was really cool. And this was only $6, so. Yeah, he would be complaining about how he, um, how I never do his feet for him and all that stuff. So, 
we're gonna get it done um it's a little hot in here i'm about to go into bills next because tj maxx did not have any body scrubs like i wanted um if i don't find any that's okay i'm not about to break my back to go find some um i'm still waiting for them to call me to get my nails done but this bag was only 20 dollars, like i said so i'm actually about to use it now so i'm taking off all this stuff off of there and the only thing I hate about going to TJ Maxx, I start seeing stuff and I'm like, oh, this is cute. This is cute. This is cute. And then next, you know, you spent over a hundred dollars and you're like, how, how did I get reeled into this? But yeah, got this piece of thread. Take that off. I take out all this stuffing in the bag. And then I'm gonna just throw my wallet in there. I think my wallet can fit in there. Let's see. It's a little tricky, but hey, it fits. And then it has this little um little pouch right here that I would think you could put your phone in, but my phone is too big. And I have the 12 Pro Max and my phone is not gonna fit in that um in this little pocket, but maybe I could put like some lip gloss in there or something. I think that's a good use for this little pouch or maybe like my id so it's like quick grab kind of thing i don't know but anyway here's the purse so cute and it just reminds me of that prada purse you know what i'm saying y'all know what purse i'm talking about twenty dollars baby tj maxx can't go wrong with that um and yeah things like hook one but yeah, I'm about to go in bills real quick to see if I can find some scrubs. If I can't find no scrubs, that's fine. I will just um, take that L. Oh, I should go to Bed Bath & Beyond to try and find some cutlery. But I feel like their cutlery might be a little expensive. But we'll see. Because um, that's the only thing we did need was some cutlery. So, Ooh. I'm going to do like a little cross by, you know what I'm saying? And uh, now I'm finna go drive over to Beals and then go to Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, see if these people call me back to get my nails done. And that's it. That's it. So I'm in Beals and it looks so boring in here. Definitely like a bootleg version of TJ Maxx. But um, these is bubble baths. Bath salts. I want bath salts. I want like scrubs. Nobody has scrubs. What's going on? Shoes are empty. Hmm. Nothing. This is kind of nice, and this one too. Hmm. So, guys, I found some cutlery and bills. It's only twenty dollars for a set of twenty. So I just came out of Beals. Um, I was able to find some cutlery, so I do not have to go in Bed Bath & Beyond. I bought a little drawer cutlery, cutlery organizer and then just a candle. So um, I'm done spending money. Well, except for getting my nails done, but I'm done with that. No more going to stores. Oh wait, I lied. I said I wanted to get a little outfit. I got an outfit at home, so that's fine. Um, so now I'm just waiting for the new place to call me so I can get my nails on. <clears throat> so cleaner earlier, I got this big old trash bag in my car and I don't know what these people were doing. I don't know if they were like fishing or something like that, but they had this empty box and now my car starting to smell like fish. So I need to get rid of this, like, this box because this stuff stink. So I just remembered I do need to go somewhere else. I need to find the foot soaker and I probably should just go on Bed Bath & Beyond and see if they have it. Hopefully it's not too much because they had one at Walmart for $20 so um yeah. So 
so my nails are done i went with pink instead of the same nude i need to take this deck on box out my car because my car smells like fish now and it stinks so bad oh my gosh but i'm trying to think where can i throw it away anyway now to go to walmart to get that foot soaker because i went in bed bath and beyond and they had a foot soaker and guess how much the thing was 71 dollars. anybody paying no 71 dollars when they got one at walmart for 20 so I'm about to go to walmart and get this little 20 dollar one um so yeah i'm gonna do a spa day facial pedicure uh massage for him and yeah so i'm about to go to walmart get this foot massager go home pack some stuff up get rid of this trash out my car because it stank and i need to figure out what we're gonna eat hmm. yeah so i don't know why i thought this on foot thing was twenty dollars it's forty dollars but it's whatever and then now i'm gonna get me some scrubs <laughs> So y'all, I'm officially leaving Walmart. I got the scrub, I got the foot soaker, and oh, some feet masks and some face masks. Boom. And it was funny, I was talking to him on the phone just now. He's like, oh man, I wish you would do my feet for me. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Guess what, boo boo, I'm already headed of the curve, already headed of the game, okay, I'm saying. I ain't telling what I'm doing, but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> already there. I'm about to go to Zaxby's now to get me a salad because I'm so hungry. The last thing I had was a six-piece chicken nugget, a holiday pot, and uh, iced coffee. And that was like 10.30, like 11 um, when I was cleaning. So right now I'm really hungry. So I'm going to get me a salad and I'm going to go home. I'm going to get right. So by the time I do go see him, you know, I'll be straight. So. Yeah, he keep asking me to find him some peanut brittle. And first of all, that's old people's snacks, number one. And number two, I don't know where to find no peanut brittle at. So, he just out of luck. Out of luck. So, guys, I got me a fried cob salad from Zaxby's. I got my tenders tossed and sweet and spicy. And then I got me some good old honey mustard to shake it up. And I'm finna devour this. I'm so hungry. Um, the funny thing, I used to work at Zaxby's. I don't know if I said that before, but that was my first real. Well, actually, no, that's a lie. That wasn't my first real job. My first real job was Spirit Halloween. And then it was Zaxby's. But yeah, when I was working there, I did not like Zaxby's at all. Like, I didn't get what the whole thing about Zaxby's was. But now I like it. <clears throat> I remember there used to be a time in my life when I did not like salads at all but i can eat them now but they gotta be like drenched in dressing which probably not the healthiest but hey man you know i eat them now i like them with eggs in there and you know like chicken i'm not a fan of tomatoes i eat cucumbers every now and then but i gotta be in the mood for cucumbers um so yeah now I eat salads and before I didn't like salads so look at me growing up and getting old <laughs> y'all I'm so excited these two together are about to smell so good Tahitian vanilla bean scrub and crispy marshmallow bars body wash oh man I'm about to smell so delicious <laughs> 